Hi, George Bruno here with you, also known as the Sultan of Silver. I'm taking a little break today. It's a very busy day at the salon, and I have about 10 minutes before my next client gets here. And I want to talk about productive ways to drink when you have a huge beard and mustache. So, the first thing I discovered when I grew my beard big, I've always had facial hair as far as like a goatee or like a shadow beard, something that would be the equivalent of maybe three to five days, but never much more than that. And when the beard became big and the mustache actually came over the lip before I could actually handlebar it, I was noticing when I was at a, uh, if I was sitting somewhere in a pub, having a beer, and let's just say this is a pint glass. Obviously you're drinking a pint of beer, you drink, you end up with beer foam just all over your mustache, and it's a mess. Um, I still have to figure out a way to eat the uh, ribs and the hot wings without getting the uh, the reddish brown stripe and looking like the Joker from Batman. Anyways, but here's some productive ways to uh, drink when you have a big beard and especially a stash, especially a, a, the kind of stash that's handlebarable. And when I say handlebarable, like when I comb this down, this hair actually goes beyond my bottom lip, so you can't even see my mouth at all, but I don't like that. So, anyways, um, first thing was the my protein shake glass is fantastic. It has a, a little spout that fits in the mouth, under the mustache, flip up this little air hole thing, and it's perfect. Even when I drink a glass of water, I still get wet. It's like dripping. I look like I just came out of a, a swimming pool or something. So this is fantastic. It's worth getting one of these um, GNC health food store, whatever. Um, it, to me, it's the perfect water bottle. Um, reusable, so you're not always uh, buying plastic all the time. Coffee in the morning now, I just drink out of my travel mug that I get. Uh, and it has a, a little lip. And this little thing opens up. See that right there? And I can just open my mouth up enough when I drink where the coffee goes into my mouth and not in the stash. Because one of the peculiar, we, we've talked about this before, one of the peculiar needs of a white beard is that it, um, if it was brown or black, you wouldn't see the stains as much. But when you have a white beard, as a young guy, and I'm a, not an old guy, but I'm, I'm still young and healthy and whatever, um, what you don't want is that brassiness. You don't want food stains here or here. You see like guys who have white beards and smoke and it's like all yellow and brown here and just like really disgusting looking. Um, and I don't want the color of food or anything like on me like that. The other thing is um, these kind of cups, I guess, to-go cups, um, coffee, out and about cups at convenience stores. These are fantastic. What I would do is I would reuse them, take them home. Uh, even if I'm having juice, I put it in here and that little spout is just enough to fit into your mouth and it bypasses all the hair. I went from using uh, drinking beer from uh, pint glasses to drinking bottles because when I go to a bar now, as much as I like uh, beer on tap, draft beer, um, with the big mustache, and beard. This just fits underneath just perfect. So I can get a great, even with shot glasses, I like, I just got these with my Avion tequila, but I like this, see it's square. So it's kind of nice, so if you're doing a shot, you can still just put that corner down and do a shot like that without having tequila mustache as well. Uh, the, the other thing is I bought a pack of straws. These are phenomenal. I haven't had I haven't had straws since I was a kid, so put them in the cup like that, okay? So keep straws, uh, your smoothie, protein shake bottle, uh, your travel mug is phenomenal. Those are just some creative solutions to drink when you have the big beard and the, the big mustache. So again, this is George Bruno, the Sultan of Silver. Uh, thank you for watching. I appreciate it. Bye.